Kyle Adrian, he's a, an All-Australian, a best and fairest winner. Can you just take us through the significance of Kyle Hooker's re-signing? Yeah, look, it's a great day for the club. Obviously, Kyle was a, a free agent, so um, being unrestricted, he had the, the ability to, to move to the club of his choice. But uh, after you know a lot of discussions with him and his management, uh, it's great to, oh, well, to see that he's staying with us, and it, it's just a great feel for everyone at the club. How intense was the interest from other clubs? Oh, our understanding, uh, and we're removed from that process, but our understanding was that there was a, a number of clubs where our understanding also is that you know, he's knocked back a, a, some significant offers to want to be part of our future. Um, and it's just, again, it's just a, a vote of confidence for where we're going as a club. How valuable are these guys? We know he's a, an All-Australian defender, but he's also shown an ability to go, go forward. How valuable are those swing men in today's footy? And I think that's why there was such a, a high level of interest in him. I think that you know, there's not many you know, key position players of that quality in, in the game at the moment. And when you've got Michael Hurley and you've got uh, Cale Hooker, all Australian uh, spine players, and, and we're hopefully getting both of them back next year, uh, it's exciting times for the club. Is that why it was a five-year deal? Yes, yeah, certainly. I think that in his case, look, the market determined you know, what the contract was in the end. You know, market value suggests that he was at a certain level that we had to meet to, to get, retain his services. Um, and look, I think that what we've seen, particularly over the last couple of years, with guys like Bob Murphy and you know, Gibson and Hodge and these sort of guys, they're all 31, 32, 33 years of age, Rewalt, and they're all playing good footy. And I think with the advent of sports science um, and you know, just the, the improvement in, in technology, we're seeing that these guys are actually you know, lasting on the park a hell of a lot longer these days. So there's no reason why. He's such a diligent trainer, hard worker, that he can't you know, play until his mid-30s. So we've heard now from Heath Hocking recommitting, Travis Collier, and of course today, Kyle Hooker. Where does it sit with the other guys? Well, as we've said previously, we're not putting him under any pressure at the moment. Um, it's evolving, which is the good thing. And I think as they're seeing each of the boys signing up and recommitting to the club, that there's a fair amount of positivity. So we're really optimistic that we'll get some really good outcomes. And as I said before, I think we'll, we'll field a very strong team in 2017 on the park. Certainly a very exciting day for the club. Adrian, thanks a lot for your time, mate. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot.